the young and the restless spoilers, Nikki's hit and run hits Claire in a drunken rampage. Nikki's really getting out of control and if this keeps on happening, she's going to end up making a mistake she can't correct. And I think I've got just the storyline for it. She's fallen off the wagon again and this time, spoilers say she'll have totally wrecked a suite at GCAC, which means she'll only be escalating from here and out. So, what if Claire frees herself and runs away hoping to be saved, as she's running a car hots her, and she's left fighting for her life in the middle of the road? But it's later revealed that the one inside the car who hit Claire and ran away leaving her to die was none other than her grandma, Nikki. Victoria will not forgive her mom and as Claire fights for her life, her survival looks grim. Nikki doomed. So, Nikki has been battling her demons for a while now. But it looks like things are about to take a turn for the worse. She's gone off the deep end again, and this time, it's gonna shake things up big time. Word on the street is that Nikki's gonna trash a suite at the GCC. But it gets even crazier. What if Claire gets caught up in the chaos? She manages to break free from the wherever she's kept hidden, and bolts out of there, desperate for safety. But fate has something else in store for her. As she races across the road, a car comes out of nowhere, and BM. Claire's left fighting for her life, right there in the middle of the street. And guess who's behind the wheel? None other than Nikki herself. Yep, you heard that right. Her own grandma. Victoria's not about to let this slide. The tension between them is gonna reach a whole new level especially if poor Claire is hanging on by a thread. The odds aren't looking too good for her. How will Nikki redeem herself if this happens? I feel like Nikki's going to make a big mess, and this time, there's going to be no one to save her. Looks like we're in for a roller coaster ride of emotions. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you guys soon.